All right, Ryan, for you to be on a Ray Guy watch list at this point in the year after you know going through so many different divisions of football, how does that feel for you? Uh, yeah, it's really just humbling. Uh, I guess to token one word to it, um, it's a blessing. It's everything I've ever worked for, and uh, I mean, it doesn't mean you know anything right now. I just got to keep working, getting better every day. So hopefully, I can you know be on that watch list at the end of the year again. And uh, I just got to keep working, it, but it definitely is a blessing. Do you ever actually look at your stats and how they compare to other guys in the league, in the Big Ten, in the country? Uh, to be honest with you, I I try a great deal not to look at my stats, and I actually did not know any of my stats until this coming until like a couple of days ago when I was tagging something on Twitter. I incidentally looked at it, but no, I, I really don't look at my own stats. Um, I look at into, like my game stats. Uh, that's it. I never look at my you know season stats, and I try to avoid them at all costs. But you know when people tag you and things, it's kind of hard to avoid them. But for you being a specialist, there has to be something cool about it because most punters and kickers only really get noticed when they do something wrong. Yeah, yeah, I would, I would say that's pretty much the case. Uh, <laughs> definitely. Uh, but yeah, it definitely is a, a blessing and it, it is kind of cool to see myself up there. But like I said, I don't try not to pay any mind to it just because um, I have a job to do just like everybody else and I just have to keep doing it to the best of my ability. I try not to pay attention to the stats. How quickly do you think you got comfortable here at Rutgers? Uh, I'd say pretty quickly before the first game. Uh, as far as game comfortable, you know, it took one or two games to you know get, really get comfortable in that atmosphere. But you know, everyone here welcomed me with open arms, so it made it pretty easy to adjust. What's it been like kicking in the bigger stadium so far? Uh, it's been awesome. I, I love the crowd and everything like that. Um, it's been windy this year. As far as uh, my past years, it's been a lot windier this year as far as just, you know, typical games. But uh, definitely a blessing playing in front of the bigger crowds. I'm guessing that the big house has been on your calendar for a while. Yeah, that game has been circled for me uh, going back home. And, uh, you know, I've played other games in the Midwest, Nebraska, Illinois. But just, you know, Michigan is clearly my hometown. And, you know, I grew up going to those games. So it'll be, it'll be a fun time going back there. Where do you think that you're improving or what are you learning as this season goes on? Is there anything different about being a punter in the Big Ten? Uh, yeah, I've touched on it before. Just there's no room for error really at this level. The athletes that I'm punting to and the athletes that are you know rushing and uh, everyone at this level is just you know they're bar none. They're they're amazing and uh, this just leaves it uh, up to me not to make any mistakes really. So there's no room for error. Billy Taylor's a guy that kind of caught a lot of people by surprise the way he won that job. How is he to work with and and what is he like as a snapper for you? Yeah, Billy's great. Uh, he, I've never had a snapper like him. He snaps it extremely fast. So. Definitely helps me knowing that I don't have to worry about where the snap's going to go. He's going to put it where it has to be and uh, helps me focus on just my job because he, he's an amazing snapper. When you're a punter, how important is it to have a guy that can get down the field the way Billy does? Uh, it's really important. I mean, that's another gunner for me. You know, uh, we got the two outside and then him. So it just typically a lot of people leave the snapper alone. He's a great athlete along with, uh, you know, he's just a fantastic snapper. I mean, he's young, so he's got a lot of, a lot of time left here. And I'm just, I'm blessed to have somebody who can snap like him. All right. Thanks for the time, Ryan. Yep. Thank you.